want to welcome to the uh, program uh, Stephanie Germano is here uh, from Art Rental and Sales and visual artist Jonathan Hoban. How are you? Good, how good, are good you? to have you here. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, we brought along some of uh, one of uh, your pieces today, but we're going to show uh, people uh, some interesting uh, photographs that you have taken over the last little while. Uh, tell me about uh, your, your vision for these. It's called In the Playground, right? In the Playroom. Yeah, In the Playroom. Yeah. 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 Um, well, it originally started out with the idea that we often see kids reenacting things that they see in life historically whether it's cowboys and indians or just playing war games uh -huh. and taking some of the modern day sort of like tales that we have which we see on news media and incorporating that into kids play uh -huh. to show the general public what it is that kids see on a daily so, basis so world events that we would take in in a different way as adults yeah featuring children in those situations yeah i mean i think that we forget sometimes that kids witness all the same stuff that we do as much as you want to shield them. True enough, eh? mm -hmm. yeah it's true yeah and it's interesting work uh, some that has uh, drummed up some controversy from time to time yes right <laughs> uh the beauty of this is uh, and one of the things we want to make sure people know as uh, stephanie is that uh jonathan's work you can have it in your home without buying it you can actually. Um, Jonathan is in the Art Rental Sales Gallery, which is a small gallery space within the Ottawa Art Gallery. Yeah. And we, you can purchase the piece, but you can also rent it. So it makes it more accessible. Um, you don't have to be stressed out about um, mm. Mm. buying it at cost. So you can right. rent it, keep it in your home if you're having a party and you want um, like a. Or piece you just to find discuss. it interesting for a while because a lot of people, when it comes to photographs or art, change it up. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. 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 And with this specific series, because each image has its own thing, you can change the image that you have, yeah. and you can rotate which image. This is the the, the, the big uh, picture that you brought in today. What's this one called, John? It's called uh, Abu Ghraib, and mm -hmm. which is a play on the prisoner of use at Abu Ghraib. But the idea that kids' perceptions of what it is, they all often they yep. don't even understand the title. There, there's what you could have in your home. You, know, you could rent this or yeah. buy it if you want. Yep. Right? If you find it that interesting, you want to have it in your home. Now... Um, we're going to show a, a series of the ones that uh, you've done. What's this one called? Uh, that's Boxing Day, and it's about the Boxing Day tsunami. So the idea that, you know, kids over there, I mean, we are as we're boxing up our presence here in Canada, the idea yeah. that they're boxing up bodies. What, what, what do you make <laughs> of the adults' reaction to your work? Um, it's interesting. Like, I, there was quite a huge response. Um, after I was on CNN, I had, I had received hate mail. Um, uh, people threaten to kill me, um, but you know I, I find it it's interesting. I think the majority of people understand the work and get the the point, and that it actually is uh, pro kids and sort of acknowledging sort of the darker elements that kids have to deal with. This one is about uh, the death of Lady Diana, correct? Yeah, Diana's dead is the title of that piece. Right, and you can see, now look at it, everybody, and you you'll see what's going on here. Okay, so I, I watched some reactions of people this morning to uh, their first viewing of your photographs, and it's interesting to see they almost want to back away sometimes, yet they can't pull themselves away. Mm -hmm. Because it's interesting to put young people in a situation and get their, their impressions from your photographs, you know. Yeah. What were... What were the kids' reactions to it when you're taking these photographs? Well, I mean, kids react like what you expect. Like, kids, when they play water pistols, they're pretending to kill each other. And we, we never see, think that that's sort of that's weird. That's not so, a problem. No. no. And so as soon as you actually sort of acknowledge where they're getting the idea of how to hold a gun, because no kid has to be taught how to hold a, a handgun. They just know. Um, when you see the actual source material, which might be news, we as a as adults are forced to acknowledge the fact that we can't shelter them from yeah. it. So this, this one is about the young lady who died in Aruba, right? She yeah. Was, yeah. She um, went missing on spring break. Yeah, right? that one's called Spring Break. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Natalie Holloway. That's right, Natalie Holloway. Yeah. So there's visual cues and all the all the pieces, but just you know, it's dealing with more extreme way of how kids might express what they see in their yeah. play. Like I'm, I don't expect kids to actually play 9/11 no. like this picture. Mm -hmm. No, I'm sure people can figure out what that. But one But they is. get bits and pieces from it, and they do incorporate that sort of stuff into their play, and do, they carry that with them. Do the reactions of people like you know, nobody wants to get death threats, but does it bother you or? Just... I got over it real quick. Like I developed a thick skin. The first really time quick. I bet it's. Yeah, it was like, a little whoa, jarring. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, but um, I think that you know. I think that this particular art story, um, because it had such wide appeal, because it's dealing with issues that we've all sort of witnessed, yeah. that suddenly the general public is getting involved. And then you get every wing nut. So yeah. uh, you know, I took it in stride, but um, 
it's nice that the work is being talked about and it's being shown around the world. You're right. Yeah. I think, I find it fascinating. I don't know. But, and people can uh, hear what you have to say tonight, right? Yeah, um, that's the importance of these artist talks that we've started at the gallery is we take these local artists and we allow the public to come in and it's a casual atmosphere, it's comfortable, um, and you can ask your questions. It's, it kind of makes the artwork more personable because they meet Jonathan. Yeah. And he talks about his processes, the ideas behind it. and people start to develop more of an education of the art, which you don't usually get sometimes when right. you're like going through the photos in a gallery setting. What time and where tonight? It's at the Ottawa Art Gallery at uh, 2 Daly Avenue Arts Court yeah. at 6 p.m. And people can find out more about the idea of renting the art. And yeah, of Not course. just Jonathan's, but others, right? No. Yeah, there's a lot of other pieces there, yeah. and they're all on our website, actually. I think it's pretty cool stuff. Good luck with it tonight. Thank, Thank you. you. That's neat. Yeah.